aim of our study or this project that is funded by UNESCO is to look for alternative methods or strategies that can be used to manage bananas, sanctimonious wilt. The agricultural practices and cultural practices out there are very ineffective to control banana wilt disease. As we all know, the indigenous or local farmers are using urine or ash, they are cutting down plantations, so they either find these practices too cumbersome and expensive or they are just not effective. The technology that we want to develop is that we call the bacteriophage technology. So we have been out in the field, we have collected goat dung. We suspect that these goats have been feeding on these infected plants. And we think that these infected plants, much as they are infected with the bacteria, but also they are targeted by the phage or the microorganism because these microorganisms are specific for these bacteria. They are looking for these bacteria so that they can also amplify or grow or survive in these ecosystems. Maybe one thing that I have to say is that we have also explored into plant extracts, okay? We also have found plant, two plant extracts that also have therapeutic benefits or they can kill the bacteria that causes banana wilt and that is the Sanctomonas. We also want to explore that arm of research so that now we have two products, the product of the phages and the product of plant extracts and ask questions. Can we bring them together? Can they co coexist and co-work together? Do they work best singly? We have been having several methods for controlling these pests. For example, we have the culture methods, we have the chemical methods that have been kind of efficient, however, they have their side effects. For example, when you look at the chemical pesticide, they have the residual toxicity in that they affect the humans and animals whenever we use them. So here we come with the biocontrol strategies where we are using the natural products to kill these pests. pests. We have been running this project as students, we've gained a lot from the project, whereby we have been able to access the theological bit and apply it into a practical.